Well, he sold the house uh, after they threw me out into the street and my son. And uh, I haven't heard from him since, not a word. Most of the people that I considered to be my friends before I lost my house were nowhere to be found once I became homeless. My son and I have been staying on sofas. We stayed in our car when we first lost our house 15 months ago. Like if you go to a shelter, like I went to this one here with my current housing crisis situation, they said that they didn't have funding for therapy and that they didn't have any funding for their programs for transitional housing. And the most that they could do was uh, refer me to a shelter, which I went to uh, to see if they could let me, me and my son stay there. And they said, because he's over 18, we wouldn't qualify for their family shelter. My son had a severe head injury when he was 16, and he's 27 now, but he's very dependent on me. When I tell places that I'm applying for housing that we're staying on a sofa, then they don't consider us being homeless. They say that we're, that we have a house, but the people that we stay with have been saying, you can't stay here. When are you going to leave? When we look at people who are homeless and we say, well, they must have made some bad choices. It's not true. Shit happens in life, and there's supposed to be safety nets to protect us, but when you come out of a situation and you see that there really is no safety net, it's, it's sad. I mean, it's, it's depressing. And if you don't have family or friends that you can rely on to help you, you're at the mercy of the streets. I just recently, in the last year, discovered that my love for music and my love for people could be combined. Like, I want to bring the drum circle to the assisted living place. Everybody gets their little bells or their thing and sing along. It's not going to be a performance as much as it's going to be an inclusive community. And if I could help someone have some happiness in their life, inspire and then light up again inside, then that would be a career that I would love to have. So once I'm done with my getting myself a place to live and making sure my son is safe, that's the area that I'm gonna pursue for my goals. They're on hold right now, but they're not they're not gone. So yay! <laughs>